Hello and welcome to Zoom Pigeon Gaming. Today we're playing Game of Thrones again. It's episode 5, it's finally out. Oh, apparently this is really good. I don't know anything about that other than that it's really good. <coughs> so, let's play Game of Thrones. I'm actually really excited for this again. Oh, and I've got face cap. Hello. Because you get. Because it's, I don't really have many voice reactions, it's more facial reactions. And my facial reactions can be pretty weird. So, let's do this! Okay, play. Let's play this game. Let's do this gameplay. Eh, uh, a lot of stuff. <clears throat> okay. When you play the Game of Thrones, you win or you die. That is true. This is episode 5 of 6, like, seconds last episode. It went well last time. That's concerning. Really concerning. Um, why did it go well? What's gonna go wrong this time to make me regret everything I've done? Ever. <coughs> <coughs> Ow. I have a Capri Sun. Other Capri Suns are available. Previously on Game of Thrones. You'd help the second sons. Guide them into Marie. I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. You think you can reason with a wildling? No, I'm, uh, I'm a friend. Don't move. This is my sister, Sylvie. I have to get in there, Sarah. Lord Whitehill is up to something. He's conspiring against my family, and someone in there is helping him. Andros is hiring sellswords. Hundreds of them. What? He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough to march against Ironrath. Shit. Talia, I, I may be leaving you here with a traitor. Find out who it is. Oh no, Ramsey Snow is there. Fuck. Shit, no. Rodri! I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Oh god. Oh fuck. Shit. I was just telling your sister. Father's been looking to make a match for me. And Talia's been such good company. Think she likes me? Or maybe your mother? Her flower plucked is still a flower. Just dies more quickly. We could be a family, Lord Forrester. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Your mother may uh, need some convincing. You'll never marry either of them. Never's such an awfully long time. But let's put our happy day to the side for a moment. Walk with me. Oh, fuck off. You won't need your sword. Not where we're going. I'm not going without my sword. I'm afraid you are. What? Oh, Here, I'll help you. Whoa. Don't <laughs> touch me. Get off my sword. What the hell? You just took my sword. There. You can see that. <sighs> Doesn't that feel better? No. Oh. Bastard. You're coming Let too. Literally. This is Lord's business, not a child's. I say she comes. I don't trust her with my men. What an asshole. Okay, I was hit with my cane. Like, How fares your father, Lord Bolton? Better than yours. <laughs> Polite of you to ask. 
I loved playing in the woods when I was your age. Still do. So many places to hide. I've gotten very good at finding people. Roderick? It's all right, Talia. That reminds me. Where's Griff? I expected to be greeted by him on my arrival. Bit of a disappointment to have to show myself in. Now should I know? Griff and his men are not my concern. My concerns are your concerns. I assume you forgot that when you took them prisoner. Oh, I really hoped things might be different with you. I hoped we could be friends. No, After all, don't. I was generous. I've allowed you to keep half your forest. Your livelihood. Yet you went behind my back and called in the Glenmores. I'm not sure how you managed that. The Glenmores have sworn their loyalty to my father. I knew I couldn't trust the Whitehills, so I asked the Glenmores to keep the peace. You don't need the Glenmores. You have the protection of the Warden of the North. Well, I'm certainly glad we've sorted this out. Thank you for being so forthcoming. But there's still a price. Ah. Here we are. Oh, uh, Roderick! Who's that again? You oh, disobeyed. Is it one of the Glenmores? <coughs> Disrespect me. Is that necessary? Really? Someone has to pay! You didn't think it would be you. Your damaged goods. Someone else's leftovers. Our sister has influence in King's Landing. She'll hear of this. King's Landing is very far away. I thought this was rude. Stop! Look at what you've done. I hope it was worth it. Is what it I've done? Please stop! Please! Talia, don't look away. It's very important you see what comes of disobedience. Roderick, make him stop! Please, do something! You'll pay for this, Ramsey! Please. Look at him, Talia. Oh, it's kind of painful. See what your brother's done. Please, please, Lord Ramsey. Sorry, but they'll never learn otherwise. <laughs> mercy, have mercy! Mercy, my lord! Did Roderick show mercy to Griff? This is his fault. That's a lot of blood. <laughs> I'll see you dead for this! Yes. Kill him. Kill him! And that, Talia, that was rude. is why no one likes your brother. <sighs> the poor lad's fainted. Let's give him a minute. <laughs> you want to kill me, yes. don't you? Yes. Yes, Release I him. do. Go on. Prove how strong you are. Do it, Do it for Ethan. No, Roderick. He's toying with Stella. you. I won't be able to do it, but... Oh, I tried. I'm impressed. <laughs> Woo. Lucky for me, you're a cripple. I may have misjudged you, Roderick. I came here to kill you. Now, I'm thinking. It might be far more entertaining to watch you and Lud tear each other to pieces. I never want to come back to this fucking shit stain of a hold fast. I have better things to do than to play wet nurse to you and Lud. So you'll settle this on your own. Last house standing wins. Wins what? Otherwise I'll kill you both and be done with it. There's no need for war. Lord and I have already come to terms. I've just given you the terms. They're not negotiable. Who is Lord? One is house he... left standing. Yours? Or Lad's? Is it one of the Glenmores? I, I really can't remember. remember. <laughs> oh. 
Can't leave a job half finished. Oh, ready the horses. Not sure you'll have much luck finding other allies. No. Why would you do that? Was that a really necessary bounty? What an asshole. You don't just stab someone for the sake of it. No. I mean, yes, I will happily kill Ramsey. I would look forward to it. If I get the chance to kill him, I will be very happy. Uh, I want to also kill Griff because he's also an asshole. But knowing this game, it will let me kill either of them. Even though I really want to. Oh, wow. <coughs> oh, wow. Other drinks are available. Um, but I can't just first time in a while. I haven't had one of those since I was a kid, so that's quite nice. At least I'm not a much. Pro. Episode 5 A Nest of Vipers. Okay, so Lud is dead. Was he, was he a Glenmore? I think he was a Glenmore. This is about allies. Hmm. Hmm. Let's look at this rack. Oh god, working with Roderick takes forever. I'm still surprised he's alive. <laughs> Only a monster would do such a thing. The Boltons will pay for this. They will. They will bloody pay for it. Look at this bloody Innocent blood. Innocent blood forest of lands. What would father think? He'd say, fuck the Boltons. Fuck the Boltons! Ah! How rude of that guy. Arthur. Let's look at Arthur. I'm so sorry. I thought he was called Mud. I don't know who anyone is anymore. Why? After all we've been through, must the gods continue to shit on this house? What have we ever done to them? Follow the Starks. Obey the rule of law. Ramsay Snow is a bloody savage. He shames the entire North. Yet we're bound by law to obey him. Can't believe it's fucking come to this! I miss the Starks. The Glenmore Guard are gone. Ordered home by Ramsay. So much for having allies. Ramsay says he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be yours, Royal. You'll get no argument from me. But how do we bloody fight them? We just don't have the numbers. Not yet, anyway. Uh... And they still have Ryan. Lord makes a show of being strong, but he's no better off than us. Not if the Boltons refuse Where is to... he? Where is my brother? My lady. Let me through! Uh, I may need to tell her that her brother's dead. Elena. Roderick! Tell me where he. Oh, no! No! Oh, no! No! Arthur, no! Arthur. Ramsey Bolton. It's my fault. What? I brought fault. him into this. I asked him to help. You can't blame yourself, Elena. He was a grown man. He made his own choices. But he trusted me. He always has. Hmm. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. 
He was so nervous that father called him Quiver. <laughs> and now to die like this. Tortured. Ramsay Snow did this. He's a madman. Ramsay was here because of you, Roderick. If we hadn't been your allies. Elena. I'm sorry. Oh, God. So it's gentle in me for this. Let's get you someplace warm. How do I do this, Roderick? How do I keep going? One foot in front of the other? Where do I find the strength? Know that we'll have our justice someday. Justice won't bring my brother back. True, but we can kill Ramsay. You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. Right from the very beginning. I should try to get some sleep. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I don't know what else to do. You're not alone, Elena. I'm here for you, whatever you need. Thank you, Roderick. Go on. 